Hello, my loves. How are you? How are you? How are you? How are you? I hope you are doing well, doing well, doing well, doing well. Yes, I do. Excuse me. Just has a sip of coffee. So, how was your day? Let me tell you about mine. Two out of three of my littles are being homeschooled for the first nine weeks. Don't know what's going to happen after that. My Chasey, who everybody knows is autistic, will be going to school September 14th. His wing of the school is going to be the only wing open. Because all the ASD kids cannot learn off a computer or a tablet. He's very upset that he is not going to school yet. And I told him, well, baby, they are making sure your school is very, very clean so nobody gets sick. That worked. He was He's okay with that. He will have to wear a mask every day, all day long. So, my daughter-in-law said yesterday was the first day of school. And actually, today was the first day of school. So, my son stayed home yesterday. So, Grandma got to do the first day of school today. The tablet kept wanting to update. Ember's on the computer with no camera, no mic. So she can't talk. Nobody can see her. And Logan's trying to get in his classroom. And it keeps updating. And I literally was running back and forth. Between the computer and the living room and the dining room. And there's a little half wall. So I'm whoop, zipping around the half wall. For the next nine weeks, I'll tell you what. I may be getting a lot of exercise. I'm tired. Not tired. I'm tired. Oh, my goodness. But the reason I'm here is that you don't want to hear about my homeschool problems. Oh, and my children go to school from 9, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. With Logan has a break from 12, 10 to 1 o'clock. I don't know when Ember's break is because at 12, 10 today, she had art. So, lunches are going to be in shifts, along with breaks. And then I'm going to have to make lunch for one, but yet I'm going to need to be with the other one to help, you know, make sure she can navigate the computer and she understands what, you know, the teacher's saying. Art, they draw pictures or whatever, and then we have to send it to the teacher. And music, they're going to make. We're going to make instruments here at home. I don't know. I may be sending out an SOS to all you crafty people to help me make some kind of instrument. But that's beside the fact. I have a Dollar Tree haul. I've had it for a while. A couple weeks, two, three weeks. And I'm like, I need to get this out. Because I bought stuff for the kids. But I've asked them to be quiet. This is my second video. And they haven't been quiet for either one. So, first, first thing we have, and I can't remember how many of these I bought. I just saved a box of each. Because they had to put them in their little container. But we got the sugar-free A&W. So Chasey can have his beer. And then we picked, these two I picked up is the Sun Kiss Orange Peach Mango. It was the first time I saw it. And you get a thousand milligrams of vitamin C, no aspartame, zero sugar. So what does it have in it? Um, not that I can see. It's got cir circulose. It's the same thing. You didn't put nothing better in it. And then zero sugar, 100% vitamin C, high C. This is mashing mango melon. You only get 10 in here. I mean, eight in here. You get six in the sun kissed and six in the A&W. This is good. Mashing mango melon. Love, love, love this. I tried that one. I really liked it. So we'll throw those away. That's all, that's all the food. I don't really buy a whole lot of food, but that's everything. So, let's go over some crafty things. I got these. Oh, there we go, dropping things. I got these for the wild children of mine. 
that one day we could sit down and do this and then give it to mommy so we have um the pumpkin and the wheat and we have the scarecrow that says hello autumn and then we have harvest time with the truck so they only had three of each they didn't have four of each different ones i mean excuse me and then grandma got her the happy harvest of the truck i'll be pulling some red out to do my truck in red so i figured i'd just sit down and paint but then okay more little crafty stuff i've got three of these organizer boxes that are separated and i can't remember what somebody said to use them for beads maybe Sequins might work. Sequins and beads. So that's what I think I'll put in mine. Sequins and beads. I don't have a whole lot of them. I only picked up two of these, but it's the first time I saw the pink, so I got the pink for embellishment boxes. And if I ever finish my wreath, I still can't get to my closet. I had to purge my bedroom. And I thought I'd be able to do it. Maybe after the first couple weeks, I can. But I bought these bows. The I think the wreath's gonna be too big for these bows, but I really like these bows. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them. I just bought them so pretty. Wish they had a big one. I also bought some decorative pumpkins to stick in my wreath. And I bought some purple lights. 20 of them for a dollar. Now you can get the clear 10 for a dollar. But they had, I believe it was black and purple, 20 for a dollar. So, my thing is, why get 10 for a dollar when you can get 20 for a dollar? And purple so much prettier than clear. That's what I think. And then I got the little uh, words, the haunted, the spooky, and the beware. I don't know if I'm going to put this, I'm probably not going to put this in the wreath. I think I bought this to use for if, for Halloween. Because I'm in a Halloween collab. So I think I bought that to use for that. Because I have the 3D pumpkin wreath from last year. That I have to finish because I ran out of mesh. And by the time I went to buy it, it was all gone. So. I'm going to do something with them. I knew I was doing something. This is horrible. I have an MRI this Friday on my brain. Maybe they can find something. <laughs> Maybe I don't have a brain anymore. Oh! And I bought the pop-ups. The little dots. The little pop dots. But these aren't the pastel colors. These are the, the darker colors. Like primary colors. But they do get a little bit. No, they're all the same. I thought they got a little bit lighter. But they don't. So, I got some of those. I have a lot of the pastel ones. And these stickers I'd never seen before. This is nine of them. And they're pop-ups. But it says, not all stars belong in the sky. My soul belongs in the sea. I shell the ocean. Happy place. with the clamshell. The land and the sea where I want to be. I'd never seen these before. So, I picked up one of these. I don't know what I'm going to use them, but I have them if I need them. And then I'd never seen these before. I've seen these. These kind, the princess. But I never needed them. And I was doing something I'm like, yeah, I need more princess stickers. Now I have them. And then I got these I'd never seen, the birthday stickers. And so you never know when you're going to need birthday stickers. So I bought those, put in my sticker bunch. And I found three of these. Which ones? Okay, the crusher and that I had bought before for the boys. I never got upset because she didn't get one. I got her a Barbie, so I bought her one. But for the boys from the Starlink, I found the Shockwave and the Gas Gun MK2. So... The way that they are acting, they're not going to get that. those for a while. All right, we're down to my last couple things. It wasn't a very big haul. I kept myself 
very um this is all I could spend. I had to take, you know, something back and this is all I could spend. I picked up for Logan. Logan is my sous chef. So I think we have these though, but I picked up two of the dollar menu uh recipe books and I didn't realize he already had these. The breakfast favorites and the quick and easy bites. These are really cool. Uh, so I will just keep these and I won't have to always ask for his, but I can roll ups. I can do deviled eggs, but these deviled eggs, they put bacon on them. I think we'd better with bacon in them and then some more bacon on top of them. You never can get enough bacon. But he was, what was he looking at? Oh, the garlic bread. Does that not look awesome? Look like you just take a piece of toast, butter it, put cheese on it, throw a little bit of parsley or Italian seasoning on it, throw it in the oven, bam, you got garlic bread. I've done that before. I've done it on hamburger and hot dog buns. And then Logan has an issue. He's ODD. So he has the defiance. I can't remember what the O is, but the defiance disorder. So I bought two spot the difference books for him and Grandma to sit down and spot the differences and see if that will help him calm down and concentrate a little bit better. And then hopefully that will reflect back in his schoolwork. So Grandma's hoping that helps. And I found three and I picked all of them up. I love these. The folders, the big folder and the little folder. We got purple. We got black. Look at that checkered. And we got green. I've never seen the green before. So I picked up one of each. I will be picking these up as I see them because I think these are so awesome. And you know, with Dollar Tree, once they're gone, they're gone a lot of times. So hopefully these are to stay and they're called button envelopes. Does it get the size on them? The big one is 13 by 9, and the little one is 9 and a quarter by 6 and a quarter. I think it's good size. You can send mail. You can send a pocket letter. I mean, you can send anything. Like, if you want to send a card and some extras, die cuts, ephemera, you know, it'll fit in, in here. If it's more than the card, more than that will fit in the card, in just a regular card. But you don't want to send a box and you don't want to send like an $8 bag. So you just take that, wrap it up really good in the brown paper, address it, and send it off. And it's still kind of flat now, just a little bit bigger flat now. That's my Dollar Tree haul. That's it. It is small and compact. And I hope some you saw something that you liked. <laughs> and as always, if you can do something today, tomorrow, and, all, and always, please be kind. Say hello, smile, disinfect the buggy. If you've not joined our awesome family, hit that little subscribe button. And YouTube is not sending out notifications anymore, but we guys sure do have a lot more commercials. I'd rather have notifications than commercials. So hit that button and look for me. And I will talk to everybody soon. And remember, remember how much I love each and every one of you. Bye-bye, my loves.